guys in this video let us look at cat paw retractor so this is the cat paw retractor you can see so many of them here they look like a fork but that's bent in forward front right so it's a fork like instrument with the terminals bent inward it's bent inward they are saying it's used to retract the skin so understand that this is sharp edge so you will not retract lid or something you're retracting skin okay during lacrimal sac and lid surgery any surgery you want to do you want to retract the skin actually this became a little more of the uh, ent is look at this anyways the frontal uh, mucosal like this they are retracting actually this is trephination but similarly they will do for lacrimal sac also so you can remember the cat paw lacrimal wound retractor okay what will you say cat paw lacrimal wound retractor okay so you will retract the skin during lacrimal sac and lid surgery do not say you will lid retract the eyelid because it's very sharp you will not use this for retracting eyelid okay it retracting what skin that's it guys in cat paw retractor guys look at this this somebody has to hold them apart right there is something which can uh, hold itself like see self retaining lacrimal wound retractor is also there self retaining so it is used to retract skin during uh, surgery on the lacrimal sac like dcr dct if you are doing so basically this is self retaining this is muller's retractor okay look at this this is also very sharp so don't say anything other than skin okay and it's self retaining it has a screw and and all that right so definitely it will be self retaining what is it muller's retractor self retaining lacrimal wound retractor muller's retractor okay